We floated down that river drinking beer for six and a half hours. Not one person had to pee. Is that normal? I'd like to think my friends wouldn't pee on themselves. I know I would. That was the best thing about tubing the river. You could just paddle up to somebody you don't even know. <laughs> Talk to them while you're peeing on yourself. That's relaxed right there. If you're floating down a river drinking a beer, peeing on yourself, there's no tension there, is there? Ladies, don't get it twisted, though. We love you like a motherfucker. Whoever wrote this statement was real honest, man. Can't live with you, can't live without you. Living with you is a motherfucker. Y'all motherfuckers will find a way to fuck up a relationship when it's right at its best. You know what I mean? I don't know why y'all do it as autopilot. Things are too good. I must fuck it up. We need to talk. About what? See, that's what I'm talking about. You don't even know what I want to talk about. Why do y'all play that fucking riddle me shit? Bitch, what the fuck you want to say? Ain't no goddamn psychic. You didn't notice I did my hair. Your hair? This is what we talking about? I didn't notice you did your motherfucking hair. <laughs> you did it. You like it? Ha <laughs> ha. You gonna fuck up this relationship with that bullshit? All right, bitch, let's play this game. You didn't notice I got a new gray hair on my left nut. Now we both didn't notice some shit. <laughs> Hey man, it's me. Stopped by your house earlier and seen the boat was gone. Your wife said you was fishing with Jeff, whoever that is. Anyways, just thought I'd call and say I hope you hook a 10 pounder. Then I hope your line breaks. You lose your favorite lure. You fall out of the boat. Lose your favorite rod and reel. Did I do something? Is it me? Call me when you get back. I'm driving in a car, and my friend Billy's driving, and my friend Kenny's in back, and I broke wind ever so daintily. The next thing I know, we're in a guardrail, and my friend Billy slumped over, and he's mumbling. He goes, I hear you. I said, Billy, what's the matter? What are you saying? Oxygen! Now Kenny has his jacket wrapped around his fist. He smashes the window open. He's got half his body hanging out, breathing for dear life. Ah, ah, ah. State trooper comes by. Is this alcohol? No, it's gas. Hell yeah, if you a little motherfucker my size, shut the fuck up. You know what I mean? Because them ain't the scary ones. The quiet motherfuckers. That's who you watch. Them the killers. Yo, the loudest motherfucker in the club is a bitch. Nigga loud because he's scared and he hope it's scaring you. Nigga, you know what I'm saying? I'm fucking up. Is this scaring y'all? Because I'm scared the motherfucker. Real killers are quiet in the mother. They don't dance, they sit in the club and hold the wall up and just be looking. And you know, they constantly got a grit on their face. Do a slow stroll through the club and they praying the whole time. God, don't let me kill nobody else today. <laughs>